Hey everybody, everyone's been missing my vlogs, I hope. One new thing I've done, obviously, is buy a truck. And it's been in one of my videos already, but I was not really using it. One of the coolest parts of having a truck is that you can do things in a truck that you can't do in a crappy little car like I have also. You like that? Yeah. You don't like that? that that's my lunch. Anyways, I've been picking up a lot of camping. A lot of camping, a lot of sleeping in my truck, a lot of just, you know, enjoying this uh, luxury Harley Davidson edition truck. And uh, I want to use it for truck camping. So that is going to be my next project. That's how I'm going to spend this afternoon. I've got a sleeping bag, of course, but problem is a sleeping bag does not make over the fact there is not enough room in the back seat of that truck for me to sleep and feel comfortable so i'm gonna have to make myself a truck camping setup all right better than what it was 10 seconds ago so we're cleaned up i've slept in the back of this truck and it was okay sleeping in the back of the truck but it was not comfortable so i got something to fix that oh i got a pump thank you Ooh. and i have no idea really what i'm doing with this thing my idea was not to do this like until i got there but what if i got on the trip and i just like couldn't go to sleep because my bed would not work Ooh, that thing is powerful. I like that my truck is off and I don't have to don't have to worry about setting it up with the truck on. It's nice. It's nice. So it's not as long as I thought it would be, but also by the time it got here, I did expect it not to be as long as I thought it was gonna be. I have no idea if it's working. Yeah, I was doing it wrong. It don't go there. It goes there. I don't have to hold it. Unless you want me to. Oh, by the way, the instructions are trash. I will be bringing a sleeping bag. I will be bringing a hoodie. I hope I don't need the sleeping bag. I hope the hoodie's enough. Oh, I got it upside down. That's one reason why this thing's having a hard time. So that looks more like the pictures. So there is, let me push it all the way over here. There is more space than the truck and there is floorboard, but I mean, it's camping. I'm definitely gonna have more equipment with me than just, you know, a torch fan. So I'm gonna need to bring other things. This is fine. In a second, I'll see if I can lay down in it. Moment of truth, can I fit in it? Y'all, I'm in my work clothes, which are bank clothes, so this is gonna be hard. First off, that feels amazing. I haven't closed the door yet. Let me close the door. All right. Oh, it did exactly what I thought it would. If I lay the truck, if I lay sideways, got my feet right there. Oh, got my head right here. Gonna have like 50 pillows on the back of my head. I think it's manageable for like a night or two. It's not a... This is not a homeless survival guide, so don't be thinking you can just be doing this. Unless you're like five foot five. I'm 5'11". Five uh, if you're six feet tall, you you're out of the tr you're out of the club, man. You can't even. Oh, dude, my shoes are adding like an inch. I'm fine. I might have to go get some more supplies for tomorrow. Don't really know yet if I'm gonna take y'all. Probably taking y'all with me. Thank you, TJ. TJ, my my buddy since like second grade, not work TJ. If TJ, if you do see this, I'm not talking about you, I'm talking about my friend TJ. Hey TJ. But then I forgot about the other T. You know what, I'm not gonna include anybody's names. Hey TJ. I was going to get supplies, but I got an idea. I came to town. My buddy Coach is out here. It just happens to be the night that he's gonna be out here, so I'm gonna see if I can get him to check out my truck setup. He's probably wondering what I'm gonna do. Whoa, Alan's out there actually playing. I'm actually weirded out. Alan's up. Get a homer. Oh! 
Only Allen. <laughs> I guess since Sports Country won, got a. Is that the name of the team? Fresh Kids of Bel Air. Oh, Fresh Kid, Kids of Bel Air. Fresh Kicks. Fresh Kicks of Bel Air won. Allen Cox, I, I, I have to ask you this as the star player and coach of this team, uh, how, how do you feel after this win tonight? Oh, uh, it's. I'm, I'm going to enjoy this win, but it ain't over yet. It's just now getting started. Is there anything you want to say to the, to the team and to the fans to assure that this playoff run is going to come out to be a success? I'll just say this. If we do our job while we're out there on the field, I'm, I'm going to like the result at the end of this season. Right. How many more games to the uh, championship? I would say about three, four more games. Three or four more games. So we, we, just, we just gotta win three, three or four more games. All right. And uh, do you feel like the team is meshing well? Do you Absolutely. Think playoff hypes hasn't gotten anybody. Yeah. We, we got all stars on our team. Huh? That's that's right, all stars. Well, Mr. Allen Cox, I thank you, and uh, we're gonna be keeping up with you as much as we possibly can, and within reason. <laughs> Appreciate it. So I want to show you, you're the first person to see it. You're probably going to be the only friend that sees this like in person oh. before I use it. Okay. Yeah, I picked you, Alan. <laughs> so uh, go, go go open up the back seat of the truck. On this side? Yeah, 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 on this side. Got me a bed. Uh -oh. That's right. Oh, I know what you're going to do. That's right. I'm going to go camping go finally. Camping. I'm going to stop, give me some more supplies. But I'm probably about to go camping. Love everyone. I'm gonna go